Hello, it's John Block. On January 14th, I'm hosting the next event in the Conscious Activism series. It's called Understanding the Queer Experience. When I was 10, my brother Rick died of AIDS. He was in that first wave of gay men to contract and succumb to the disease. And I became then what I would later know was called a straight ally. Since then, I've marched in pride several times. I celebrated very loudly the <laughs> legalization of gay marriage. I even have a pride flag in my home. Yet lately, things have been getting very confusing. The surge of pronouns is something that I feel I haven't done the best job of keeping up with. Then there's the question of what to even refer to this community as. Is it the LGBT community? Is it LGD LGBTQIA? Is it something else? Then there's the offending members of that community. And this reached a very high level for me a few months ago. I made a Facebook post, and this Facebook post was interpreted in such a way that it was seen as an attack on the gay community. And for me, this was a gut punch to say the very least. It flew in the face of everything I held sacred in this area of my life. And it left me thinking as this post was circulated around and people were commenting, why do I even bother? Is the gap simply too large? Should I not even be an advocate for equality for this particular community? But I decided to go in the other direction. On January 14th, understanding the queer experience, we're gonna be devoting ourselves to listening and understanding what is it like to be queer. And as a side note, I was instructed by someone from that community that this was the all-encompassing term of queer. We're gonna look at the benefits and challenges of being in that community. Uh, what are they advocating for themselves that we can perhaps stand behind? What is the challenges and struggles within the community itself? If you value learning, growing, connecting, empathy, and progress, I invite you to join us. I can't wait to see you then.